Be asking guys questions girls are too afraid to ask. Do guys rate girls? Do guys check girls snap score and snap map? Why do guys ghost a girl? First thing that attracts you to a girl. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys ready? Yes. Prepared? So I feel prepared. so short right now because you guys are so tall. We'll, we'll go like this. Yeah! Hey guys, what's up? It's Jenna and welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm going to be asking guys questions girls are too afraid to ask. And I have two special guests. Do you guys want to introduce yourselves? What's up guys? <laughs> my name is Tyler. <laughs> and that's it. That's it? Alright, full name, Tyler Lawrence Gray. There you go. There you go. Six one, based in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> fully vaccinated. Hi, my name is Lucas Stadvik. I'm six three. Uh, I'm based in Los Angeles, California. Please hire me because I really need it. Amazing. That's all we need to know. So make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Let's hop into this video. I'm excited but like nervous. I'm freaking out. I'm a little nervous too. <laughs> like I really look sweaty. okay, but like on the inside, I'm. You're like screaming. dying. Yeah. Okay. How do you know a guy's into you? Are there signs? That made the best noise ever. We were talking about the buttons. We yeah. have these buttons here. Oh, Whoever yeah. hits it first gets to answer the question. It's like so, a competition. Tyler, go. We're very competitive. Everybody pause. It's time to talk about Morgan and Morgan. If you're ever injured in an accident, you can check out Morgan and Morgan. In eight clicks or less, you can submit a claim without having to leave your couch. Isn't that right, Daisy? You wouldn't even have to leave here. You can be all snuggled up. For more information, you can go to forthepeople.com or dial pound law. That's pound 529 on your cell phone. Give them a kiss, Dace. Mwah. Back to the video. I don't know if a guy likes you. Well, it depends. If a guy's like really into you, he's gonna, you know, text you a lot, compliment you a lot. When you guys are seeing each other in person, eye contact, studying a lot of your features. But personally, I like to play a little hard to get because I'm oh, scared that I'm gonna be kind. too smothering. So also it's tough because they could just be like ignoring you and they're into you and you know it's like uh so the reality is you can't tell yeah but that hasn't really like worked out for me so it take the the other thing i said yeah okay yeah do you have anything to add lucas other than the, there's no answer because it can be one of two ways they can either ignore you or like smother you oh, that no yeah it's it's, it's, it's it's one of the two body language is one of them mm. if they're like angled towards you, but I stand duck footed, so I'll never be I'll never be angled towards the person. <laughs> if they lean in and like they kinda look you up and down in a in a nice way. Wait, can I add one thing? Go. <laughs> if they bully you, if they make fun of you, oh my god, they're in love with yeah, you. Yeah, if they're not gonna make okay. fun of you if they don't like you. And they just will like feel bad. Yeah, if if okay. it's if it seems like they don't like you, they probably like you. If well, that makes sense. Yeah, that answered everything I need to know. Great. I'm sure. <laughs> do guys keep a kiss count? Yes. You do? Okay. Yeah. I have one in my notes. Okay, you wanna you wanna spit it out? Got the camera. Pull up the notes, Lucas. Got the camera. Do you have one? No. Really? You don't? Well, like I don't keep it in my notes. I could probably like pull from memory like one by one. <laughs> oh yeah, that <laughs> oh, oh god. That okay. Yeah. Is it bad if a guy takes a long time to respond? Oh <laughs> I got it first. No, okay. because I think guys almost want to make it seem like they're not waiting for a girl to like reply back. So they'll be like, all right, I won't check that for like 30 minutes. You know what? Maybe like an hour. Okay. Again, it's like that. They don't want to smother, but they don't want to like act like they don't care. Okay. Yeah. All right. Like this, you have something to add? I disagree. Really? Well, oh, you do, bro. You I'm the type do. of person that, like, if I see a Snapchat, I don't care if they waited, like, seven hours and I see it in, like, the first five seconds, I'm responding. Okay, so Tyler plays games, Lucas does not. That, that is true, actually. <laughs> that is true. You're just gonna throw me under the bus here? A thousand percent. Oh, okay. you heard it here first. Tyler All right. plays games. All right. Me? Me? I never. I would never play games. <laughs> you better games. watch out, Lucas. <laughs> it's on now. I told you, I'm competitive. <laughs> okay. Explain a time you got an ick from a girl. I should have thought of the answer before I pressed the button. Yeah, see, okay. now you're all competitive. <laughs> now you're all competitive. A girl one time tried to do a British accent in front of me and it did not sound British at all. And she wasn't British? Oh, it wasn't. Yeah, she wasn't British and she couldn't do one. And it I just. I feel like that's kind of cute. And I. Oh, it would have been cute if she. If she was like, hello. But she did not do it right. But bro. it's like the thought that counts. But I guess you're right. If it was like really bad, I would have been like. It was touching Australian. Like, it was not British. Okay. It was close to Australian. I got all right. one. Okay. 
if a girl like disrespects her family members at all in like an actual like mean way it kind of shows like that red flag of like okay like how, what are you laughing at bro <laughs> So respectful. I've experienced that one before. Do guys check girls' snap score and snap map? <laughs> guys are really, really okay. hesitant to hit okay. that. Okay. Like, is well, you hit first. the button? I don't. I, I don't think, okay, maybe snap maps if she has it on. Just to be like, hey, if you're on Snapchat and you're not texting me back, what are you doing? The snap score? I don't check that because she could be snapchatting like a friend or her mom if her mom's on snapchat I check snap score like when I add someone on snapchat just that's to see fair. what I'm getting myself into I'm like, oh 900,000 that's kind of interesting. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Mine's kind of close to that okay, but I've had it since I was I said, okay. old. Um, <laughs> Wow snap map. I don't know like if she's not answering me like she can go do what she wants Like I'm not gonna control that like okay it's just like keeping a little mental note, you know? Yeah, it's just, it's just in the back of the mind. <laughs> it's like, okay. All right, first thing that attracts you to a girl. Just the first thing. Be completely honest. Um, I don't want to be brought and say like personality, but like first How does that, what do you, if you see someone across the street, you can't yeah, judge bro, them by their personality. You're, you're like, oh, that girl has a great like, personality. I've never talked to them, but she, okay. she probably said, she's probably nice. Okay, so we're talking like <laughs> physical features. Yeah, like you see someone across the street, you're like, oh. Yeah. Um. Smile, like nose. Certain features complement other ones depending on like what you have, you know? Like if you have a really nice smile okay. and like you don't have to have like in like a perfect little like fairy nose or something like that. But if you have like a good nose, you don't have to have like a super bright, I don't know. Kind of the smile, but not the smile, it's the lips. I don't know why, bro, I'm a, su I'm a sucker for them lips. Yo, lips, I think. <laughs> yeah, you're right. There's just something like majestical about them. Majestical. Majestical. All yeah. right. I think I combined in two words. Though. Called by Lucas. <laughs> yeah. Majestical. How many X's does a girl have until it's too many? Go ahead, Lucas. <laughs> no, I, I could have one. No, yeah, I was thinking about the joke to make it a joke, but yeah. no. I don't think it's how many exes, it's how recent was her last ex. Okay, that's And is fair. she still talking to them still? Mm, because that's they always fair. are. Because, like, what's going on with that? Yeah. Why are they your ex if you're well, still, like... like... If they're your ex, you should probably cut them off. Oh, yeah. Sorry, um, it's, that it's hard, though. From experience, I don't know. I'm doing it. <laughs> That's not even me. I'm not even saying me. Mm, okay. No, it's but right. yeah, it's I think it's how recent the ex because if if she, if she has like five exes in the past, but the the fifth ex was like a week ago, we're gonna have a problem. But okay. if the fifth ex was like a year ago and she's healed, cool. Okay. Yeah. That's fair. It don't matter. Do you have anything to add to it? Um, no. I was just gonna say like if they have like so many exes that they can't even like remember how many they have. Mm. Obviously, it's like okay, maybe you're the problem. FaceTime nice. or text? FaceTime. In person. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> you're so right, dude. I hate over the I, phone completely. For really. some reason, when, when I can't talk on the phone, nobody can be home because I live alone. <laughs> and I would still be like, hey, how you doing? Like, not even weirdness. I just don't want to be loud on FaceTime. Yeah. It just makes me nervous. Okay. So text. Does height matter? Yes. Really? Yeah. If they're getting close to me, it's I'm a little alarmed. D1 babies. <laughs> yeah, that is true. That You're is gonna true. give birth to like the next LeBron James. But dude. at the same like, time, I don't want kids. And if I did, god damn it, I'd throw them in the industry so fast and make would myself you? so much money. I'm joking, Whoa. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, Whoa. I'm joking. They can't be like under five feet, because then that's a little too short for me. Okay. And they can't be like over like 5'10. That's like the range, five to five ten. I got no preference. Just don't be taller than me, because then I'm gonna be insecure. You could be pretty short. I don't know. I don't mean to laugh. That was just funny, <laughs> dude. Like I want to be looking up. <laughs> like what? Then it's like, how she does has to lean down to kiss you? Like she gotta lean down, platform Cute. shoes, and just like living in a lie, you know? Like, okay. Yeah. Do you mind if your girl has a lot of guy friends or a guy best friend? No. However, if she's talking about them all the time, it's a red flag. That's going to bother me. Look, it's her life. Mm -hmm. If she's not going to be loyal, then I'm going to cut it off. I'm not going to be like, no, you can't hang out with them. No, you can't hang out, hang out with them. But like, if she's like, oh my God, like Brad is literally so funny. We've been, he's just my friend. And like, 
you know, she's always talking about him, always texting him. I'm like, yo, are you like in love with this kid instead? Like then it's mm. then it's a problem. Then it's too much. Okay, fair. Yeah, you're a better man than me. Hell no. <laughs> no <'cause laughs> really? No, okay. no, no, no. Look, look, if it's a recent guy friend, yeah. please don't even bring up his name around me. Please don't see him. If it's like a childhood guy friend, go ahead. You get jealous, I guess? Oh, yes. Okay. Just because I have, a, I have my valid reasons to be jealous. I'm not controlling. I just think if you have a, if it's a recent guy friend, don't, don't hang out with him alone. You can hang out with yeah. him. Yeah. Don't, don't be doing that alone. Yeah, that's... <sighs> I think if it's in groups, it's one thing, but if it's one-on-one, -on -one, that's like a date. Literally. It's like, what about if the roles were reversed? It's like, okay, if you want to go hang out with your guy friend all the time, I'm going to go hang out with the girl all the time. Mm. We're not going to do anything. Ah, so are you tit for tat? Mmm, definitely. I feel, I feel <laughs> definitely. Are you kidding me? Like, I'm not playing around, dude. Like, <laughs> Alright, okay. Do you guys like when girls make the first move? See, I have anxiety, so yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. See, I get nervous. We both have very yes. bad anxiety. Sometimes it will take me like two hours into like hanging out with someone till they're like, are you going to kiss me? And I'm like, uh, I didn't know you wanted to. <laughs> Even though I'm like, they came over here. They smell really good. It's like 12 in the morning. What's going on? No, I Yeah. Oh, we're really exposing yeah, ourselves out here. Yeah, you guys. Too. <laughs> I kind of love it. Okay, That's do you guys scary. compare their new girl with their exes? <laughs> yeah, I feel like you have to. There's good things about an ex and there's bad things about an ex. Mm -hmm. And it's like, okay, this new girl, is she, is she more on the good side or the bad side? Fair. <laughs> do guys make up scenarios about girls they like? All the time. Like what? Like listening to music? Going to bed at night. Like if I'm really into a girl, like yeah, she's gonna be on my mind a lot, and I'm gonna imagine us like, yeah, I'm a little bit of a hopeless romantic. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Yeah, I picture the wedding. I picture. The <laughs> oh yeah, I <laughs> picture like us on like our deathbed. I picture all having great <laughs> kids, bro. Like yes, like I picture us getting like buried right next to each other. Like oh, dude, it's that's romantic, whole, honestly. It's yeah. the whole thing, and then when it doesn't work out. I, that's why I make I, that's why I'm more sad. But then it's like, okay, we're buried in the other and then we're buried in two different cemeteries. You're in Washington, I'm in like Arizona. It's like, oh, I guess you didn't wanna Yeah, you know, I guess you didn't wanna to die with me, you <laughs> maniac. Selfish. <laughs> yeah, you selfish. Okay. Do guys stalk girls on social media? Damn, that was like a tie. You go first. Yes, 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 yes. Do you stalk girls? Yes, dude. Yes. Like Well not in person. No, that's not a bad. Before I go on a date with somebody, I will, I'll, re I'll look them up on Google, just so I know they haven't, like, gone to jail. <laughs> I mean, yeah, fair. or just, dude, honestly, like, the thing of, like, you know, go through their social media, um, go through their tagged photos sometimes, just oh. to see, like, what they're up to. Like, yeah. if they're, like, okay. you know, like, tagged photos of, like, clubs every night, I'm just like, it's a no -no. this isn't really a date to you, is it? I also send their their uh, socials to my mom, and she does it. She stocks them for me. Too. Do you really? Hundred percent. Every time. My sister helps me. With I'm that. like, mom, yeah. go. No way. My mom will send me like a whole synopsis back. <laughs> what do you guys find annoying about girls? <laughs> <laughs> when they talk about their guy friends all the time. That's like one of my biggest pet peeves, dude. Because okay. it's just like, are you trying to make me jealous? Like, are you trying to make me like you more? Because it's only gonna like turn me off even more. You wanna yeah, bro, I'm so that. deep in thought. I don't like, actually, that's a lot. I was gonna say I don't like the chase, but I like the chase. But sometimes I don't like the chase. And a lot of the girls like the chase. And I don't want the chase. <laughs> <laughs> do you guys have a type? And if so, do you believe types are a thing? Well, I guess I should rephrase that. Do you believe types are a thing? And if so, do you have a type? <laughs> okay, go first. I do believe types are a thing. There's certain types that you're like attracted to and not attracted to okay which is the definition of a type <laughs> good job lucas thank you everyone just moment wow, of silence was... my type is not so much looks it's more of like they gotta be, they gotta make me laugh if they don't make me laugh then i'm like mm. my type when i was like growing up was blondes but then a lot of blondes mess me up in life Mm. So now it's it's so that can set so you back to your type can change yeah, over fair. time because of what the your type has done to you. So that's fair. I also feel just people become less attractive over their actions. 
Mm. Oh, definitely. Are you kidding me? Like, you could be, like, really attractive, but if you're, like, not a good person, then you're ugly. Completely. Like, oh, yeah. If you have an ugly personality, like, it's going to show all over your body and face face as well. Yeah. I add to that? Of course. You could be attracted to, like, a specific way that someone acts. Mm -hmm. Like, if they're, like, bubbly or if they're, like, chill. Or you could just be attracted to blondes or brunettes or, like, you know, different ethnicities and races and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, But personally... I don't have a type except personality. They definitely need to be like bubbly. Do you believe you can like two people at once? Yes. Being in like a like a love triangle sort of deal is a very like weird thing. It's fun though. It is fun. Well, it's fun if you're the one who likes the two people. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. If you're in the other boat and you're like one of the choices, it you're like on a dating show. It's like The like, Bachelor in real yeah. life. That's true. That kind of like just happened to me. Oh, wow, well, I guess. Do you but, want to talk about it? No, I'm okay. I have a therapist. Do you guys like being called cute, or what's the best compliment? Call me hot. That sounded like I was conceited. If you're gonna, <laughs> if you're gonna call me anything, call me hot. I like being called pretty. Mm-hmm. Okay. It makes me feel like... Like, they actually, like, think about, like, my features and stuff. I was gonna say compliment more, like, specifically. What you like, not just like, oh yeah, you're cute. Mm. But like, what's cute? Like, it's my yeah, personality. Yeah, because they could, they could really like... just be capping. Yeah, or exactly. Then they're just like saying like, you're cute out of like, pity. Opinions Ooh. on homie hoppers. Oh, and, I mean, and, I, it's an ex- extra But man. also, bro. What? <laughs> So quickly. Yeah. I hate it. I hate it. Okay. It's it's just like in my opinion, it's almost like disrespectful. Okay. But like it, it messes up a friend group. You know what? I get it. I get it in the sense. <laughs> We're spilling on the team. Why do guys ghost a girl? Bored. You know what, you don't need to say anything else. <laughs> I'll give the more, you know what, I'm noticing this is like an angel and a demon on your shoulder right now. I don't know how to say that like, you just don't I don't it. want to talk anymore because like I don't want to be mean. So instead I just sort of like distance myself. And yeah, that's probably like worse than being straight up and just being like bored and being like, yeah, like I don't want to talk or hang out anymore. Ghosting, regardless, it, it hurts. Like it getting ghosted hurts. So like I've I've done it. I know you've done it. We're both bad people. It's all right. Yeah. When somebody ghosts you, should you reach out to them or just leave it? Like I said, like I've ghosted people, and when people ghost me, I get frustrated, and then I'm like, you know what? This is the universe literally being like. Don't be a hypocrite, Tyler. You've ghosted people, imagine how they felt. So you can't even you can't even get slightly upset because they could be ghosting you for, you know, one of the same reasons that you ghosted someone else. So Oh my god. Oh Lucas <laughs> don't care about the question though. Yeah, no, no, I do, I do, I do. No, I had something. Then Daisy came um, in and just distracted you. Wait, if if you play. get ghosted. Oh my god, your face is so fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> I'ma look directly into the lens. Okay. If you get ghosted, text them constantly until they respond to you and take you back. <laughs> if you think they're gonna get annoyed, they're not. They're playing because they yep. played when they ghosted you. Mm. All right. Good morning, America. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys do at sleepovers? <laughs> <laughs> um. Do you guys even have sleepovers? It's not so much like a sleepover. It's, it's not like, like, you want to come over and sleep yeah. over? It's like, it's you know, like, if we go out and it's like really late, it's like, yo, can I like crash at your place? And then yeah. we'll just like make some food and like, you know, maybe like watch a movie, maybe like read each other like a bedtime story. Yeah, cuddle uh, a little bit. Uh, cuddle a little bit. Bath together. Bathe together. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of like talking about this kind of stuff. Yeah. And being like, why can't we just call up a field, man? Like, <laughs> we'll, like come home from like, an event or like a place and just be like, damn, 
<laughs> yeah, we, yo, this happened to us like two nights ago. Yeah. We were in the Uber ride back and we were, we had like a 30 minute conversation about how no girls wanted to talk to us. Oh, sorry guys. But we also, we were like. We also didn't really talk, talk to, to any yeah, girls. So like, we were like, they gonna come up to us. And they didn't. What's something you wish girls did for guys more? Behave, so. <laughs> I'm not laughing. <laughs> I already know what you're gonna say. <clears throat> uh oh. Be the big spoon. Sometimes I just wanna go to sleep in a ball. Alright. Okay. And just feel the warmth of you're somebody. You're so right. Yeah. Girls, if you're watching this, big spoon, your lover. <laughs> <laughs> this is making me want a girlfriend. I'm like getting myself excited. How many dates before the first kiss? Zero? Like one? I actually like more of a a slow burn. On the third date, mm. that will like that will start like my romanticizing like That's know, when the scenarios start. Like, yes, that's when I start like thinking about them before I go to bed and I'm like, what's gonna like happen with that? Like I do I kinda like them? But like I feel like if it just gets rushed into it, it's just like oh. Have you guys ever kissed on the first date? Yeah. Yes. Kiss as in peck or like or like cash out. I don't know. The thing is, like, the first date, peck. Just to see if, like, if there's that spark. That's like, fair. That, that's that's fair. And then, like, second date, passion. 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 <laughs> yep. Um, with or without makeup? Without. Definitely without. Oh, I didn't even. Without. 100%. Sorry, I was a little aggressive with that. Makeup can make girls look very pretty. I like it when I see like them at an event and they're wearing like cool makeup. It's like, oh wow, it just fits like the entire style of like what they're doing. Mm -hmm. But like, if we're just like hanging out, like you don't gotta come over in like a face full of makeup. Like, it's chill. We've hung out before. I know what your face looks like. There's no one here to impress except for me. But like, you don't gotta do it with that, you know? Yeah, no makeup. Bare face. Unless you need it. <laughs> wow. That was a joke. Dude. Oh my god. I'd like to sincerely apologize for, <laughs> for the remark. Yeah, that you're gonna have to make like a whole apology video <laughs> after this. Okay. Sit down, a truth video. <laughs> Last question. Uh oh. Do guys rate girls? Rate as in like, like, like 10 out of 10. On a scale? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, kinda. So you go to your buddies and you're like, oh, she was like a 10 out of 10. <sighs> it's, it's more like, of like. I think there's like a different way. I think it's like bad, mid, good, fire. <laughs> fire. Dude. Fire. That's what you said. Mid, good, fire. Fire. Um, we usually do say that. Even if it there's one like above fire, that's like a 10 out of 10. Like yeah. if you're like, dude, she's literally a 10 out of 10. Like we're expecting this girl to be like a goddess sent down to earth. Like. Okay. And that's called passion. <laughs> well, thanks guys for answering these questions, for being open, honest, truthful. Hopefully yes. we got some of your guys' questions answered. I know I got a few of mine, um, but I'm uh -oh. still a little confused. <laughs> um, but thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Check out these guys. I'll link them down below, and I'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. See ya.